today, we've got a bit of a breaking point. Now, I've not seen what happens. I mean, I've seen as much as anyone has seen before the game. You know, I saw, I saw like, all those teasers and that. But I haven't been watching Team Amada. I haven't been watching Arrow. I haven't been watching anyone. I'm going into this blind. And I'm hoping... I'm hoping it's enjoyable. Um, hoping it, hoping it's enjoyable for, for me, for you, um, for fucking, um, you know, MI5 spies listening in. You know, all of the... Every, every, I hope everyone enjoys it. Um, I feel like normal, not really me. Hard, definitely not me. I think challenging. Challenging sounds about right. Hopefully I can play around with the assists. Um, so we'll see. Now... Going into breaking point, you've got choice of five teams. You've got Alpha Tower, you've got Aston Martin, Alpha Romeo, Haas, and Williams. You know, some some interesting choices. Actually, I, I'm a little bit surprised Aston Martin are there, quite frankly. You know, it's interesting, but, you know, good team, for sure. I reckon, I reckon I'm going to go for a team where it's actually a similar sort of setup. So I'm I'm aware that I'm aware that um you know it's it's yourself. You're a younger driver and you got a more experienced teammate. I'm going to go for a team similar to that. Going to go for Alfa Romeo. I'm going to be a sort of new younger driver, sort of replacing Giovinazzi. And then is it Casper Ackerman? I think is going to be. What is it? Um, yeah, fuck it. <laughs> uh, yeah, so Cass Brackham will be replacing Kimi Raikkonen. Yeah, cool. Right then. Um, yes. <laughs> Whoops. Right, let's get into it, guys. Here we go, guys. It starts. Oh, I need to press advance. Um, starts Abu Dhabi, last race of the season. Let's go. Yes, in the Carlin. In no, it's not London Norris. He he was 2018. It's a piece of piss. Unless it's blue fights. No, it wasn't cool. Um, brilliant. Nicholas Latifi. Blimey. Um, yeah, cool. Um, I'll be honest, I don't really know. Yeah, don't really know. Don't really know what's going on. I'm sort of just driving. There's only a six lap race as well. That's not correct. Um, Oh shit. 
Doesn't matter. That's one of my worst corners in the- Oh my god. Oh my god. Yeah, there's not- There's not much traction in these. It's- 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 Oh, it's a difficult one, you know? Right, we've got two laps to get Giotto, and then presumably we'll just win the race. <laughs> Switch to the inside is unbelievable racing. Oh dear. I don't know if we do want to take the lead, actually. Fucking slipping and sliding everywhere. It's terrible. No. Yeah, these cars are not very nice on on exit. Not very nice at all. Jeez. Brilliant. They might have also turned off damage, which would be nice. <laughs> Right, let's try and try and get a new fastest lap as well. Because like this is a piece of piss. Um, final lap. Final lap of the race. Can you, can you tell I'm going fucking hardcore mode? Oh dear. Oh dear. Deary me, that's, that's, yep. Eight minutes in, and like half of that was admin. Um, and we've already spun and used a flashback. Nice. It, it bodes well, doesn't it? Doesn't it bode well? It really does. go yeah um so we've only got one race in f1 we've already chosen the team we're going to as well it said it was the prologue it's fine it's cool fuck off sean Fuck off, Sean. Also, how are you getting lapped in a six lap race, mate? Sort yourself out. That's actually all right. the line to win the race and Fantastic. presumably the championship great drive mate congratulations yes come on and he's done it jackson's done it aiden that's jackson monaco wins the f2 championship we aiden jackson f2 win. champion up the six
And here he is, the man of the moment, Aiden Jackson. An amazing race. Look at that, that's us. That's us, look at that. This incredible driver. Indeed. Up the six. After this, I guarantee that Jackson will be the hot topic in more than a few upcoming F1 team meetings. The future's definitely bright for this young driver. I want to know what happens if we lose it. Like, are there any consequences to us just bottling it completely? Anyway, Australian Grand Prix. Oh, now you made the leap to Formula One. No surprise to anyone who's been watching your career. How does it feel to be on the verge of getting behind the wheel for your first race? To be honest with you, Will, it hasn't really quite sunk in yet. The team's given me a fantastic opportunity. It's all in a lifetime, a dream come true. So, to answer your question, I feel like a little kid. I look around and I'm surrounded by my heroes, you know? I've even had to pinch myself a couple of times. So, yeah, it, it can be a bit overwhelming. But on the track, the speed, the noise, even the smell, it's all the same. I just hope my driving is too. And what about Casper Ackerman? Are you intimidated at all having such a seasoned and experienced driver as your first teammate in Formula One? How's that relationship coming along? I've always looked to Casper as someone to aspire to. Growing up as a kid, his pictures were all over my bed and walls, you know? The dream was always to be Casper. But, as it turns out, I'll be racing alongside Casper, which is good enough for me. I get to learn from the best. Besides, every legend has to start somewhere, right? Aiden. Ooh, I like that. I like that. I can get your reaction to the obvious comparisons that are being made between you and another F1 drive. Much like you, he made the transition from F2 to F1 last season. What do you say to the press here and to your fans? who are calling you the new Devon Butler. <laughs> the new Devon Butler. I'm alright with that. Does that mean we can lose the old one? <laughs> Ooh, we won't on, like that. They like you. I don't know what you're worried about. Thanks. You know, everything's going to be fine out there, Dave. I just know it. Just do what you did in F2. Easy. Brian, I won't lay down. I think the audio is going slightly slow and then has to like pause and catch up, which is why it's a bit spazzy. You've got this. New reward available, nice. Um oh, oh we've got things. Wait, so we've got telly, yeah? Um, I'm not reading that. Uh, phone. Matty WTF1. Nice. Nice. Oh, hello. What if we decline? <laughs> hello. Aiden. B Dog, how's, how's it going? Room? Oh, hey, Brian. Yeah, I'm in my room. Good. Well, have a look around. I hope you like it. Should be everything you need in there news feeds, social media. Now you're stocked up to the lot. Just do me a favour, eh? Go on. Make sure you check your emails. I think there's a message in there for you. Oh, right. Thanks, Brian. Take a breather, do what you need to do, and I'll see you before the race. Nice one. I am interested to know what would have happened if we had declined. <laughs> um, but cool. Emails. Brilliant. Oh, for Hello? Hello, love. How's it going? All right, Ma. Yeah, it's going all right. I'm just getting ready. I saw your interview. And? You need a haircut. <laughs> all right. Brilliant. Well, thanks, I guess. But aside from that, you were great. I'm so proud.
proud of you, Aiden. And Omar, thanks. I wish I could be out there with you. This is everything you've worked towards. Yeah, I know, but you'll be at the next one. Just do what you do, and everything will be great. Thanks, Ma. And remember, mirror signal maneuver. And always stick to yep, the speed limit. Yep, always stick to the speed limit. Yep, I'll do that. Yep. I'm all over yes. Place. I know you are, love. I'll speak to you later. Good luck. Bye. No, love you. <laughs> Interesting. Um. Oh. Oh, that's that's all the viewers. Cool. So yeah, um, great to have you on board. Cool. Uh, da, 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 da. Jeff. Oh, he's got a surname now. Jeff Nelson. We. Um, fuck off. Cool. Wait. Uh, for a second I thought it was saying that Bottas was at Ferrari. Yeah. Um, ba -ba -ba -ba. I've got a PA. Nice. Um, cheers, Cass. Probably claim rewards. Yeah. Brilliant. Right. Um... Oh, that's cool. Uh, yeah, cool. Let's go to the race. Nice. Here we go, right, let's, come on, come on, let me, what do you mean? What do you mean? Oh, here we go. The Australasian Grump Rock, nine laps left. Solid start, Aiden, let's try and push it further. What do you mean solid start? There's only nine laps left. Copy that. Uh, where's Casper? He's up ahead, let's try and bring you two closer together. Oh. Here we go. Oh, Ricardo's up ahead. Yeah, that was a lie. Another lie. Casper's in P10 at the moment. Well, that's not what you want, is it? <laughs> well done, George. I think that's allowed. I'm going for you, Danny. Coming for you. Coming for you. And that is why it's allowed. I don't want to lessen the chance of points for you, Georgie boy. But I think it might have to happen. Oh, thank you for giving me space. Thank you. Um, oh, oh, he's got a little red dot. Oh. Oh, oh, shit. Well, that wasn't meant to happen. 
in case you haven't already noticed. Get fucked. Nice move. Good <laughs> I job. don't even care. You're closing in on Casper now, Aiden. Good job. Casper is directly ahead of you. Oh. Well, that's not where we were. Steady on chaps. It's okay. On this. Here comes Barber. Free of press going into turn 11. On the car. Oh, what have you done? Come on, Tom. Want to burn your walk. Looks like damage is done. It's Casper okay. He'll be fine. He's heading for the pits now. You just concentrate on race. There we have it. I'm sure there's going to be fireworks in the Alfa Romeo garage tonight. There will be. Oh, dear. Is that it? Or, oh no, we get to carry on. Or do we? I hope so. I want to overtake them. Appears to be minor. How's it feeling, Aiden? Yeah. God's okay. Understood. See how well you can do out there. Copy. You're putting a good distance between yourself and the car behind. Front is 2.2 seconds. I really, really hate how the uh, how the game audio is coming out. Cool. I was really happy with that, that first one, uh, how, how uh, the first plot that she came went as well. Go on. Brilliant. Jesus. You can tell I don't really care whether I'm good at this game or not. I sort of enjoy playing it, like, simple. Yeah? I don't need to be the fastest. I don't need to worry about not using flashbacks. It doesn't matter. Go on, that's the run said that's the run haha <laughs> get fucked you shit cunt oh fuck bit of collision you naughty naughty you teasing me you naughty naughty Oh. 
It's happened again. It's happened again. Aiden Jackson, it's happened again. Okay, you're in the top ten. Shit. Great maneuver. You made it look easy. Yeah, um, I don't know if we can or will catch Albon, and maybe Stroll, maybe not. But, uh, you know, I'll, 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 I'll try and chase him down. Yeah, looks like traction out of um, out of the penultimate corner is actually quite difficult. I'm I'm really really trying to catch these guys. Like yeah, I I want it. I reckon I can get past Stroll. Perhaps a few remaining. It's presumably Vettel and Sainz ahead of them, which I think is probably unrealistic, if we're honest. Lovely maneuver. Oh, they're just they're just gone now. Brilliant. Um, hope you like watching me dr just just drive for like three laps. Leclerc, cool. Yeah, to be fair, 2020 battle wouldn't have been up in sixth, <laughs> unless it's at Turkey. We might be sort of within touching distance of Leclerc by the end of the race. 
whether we can pass him. Oh, I think it's very unlikely. We actually have to get fifth on debut. <laughs> It's not it's not K Mag, is it? But pretty good. Oh my god. Yeah, I mean it's probably not as exciting as I thought it would be, let's let's face it. <laughs> Um, well, my driving's down the fucking drain. It's loud. Oh, these tires through to the end now. P7 now. P7. Leclerc ahead. The gap to the car ahead is 3.3 seconds. They're on old mediums. Album behind. The gap behind us is 3.0 seconds. They're on old mediums. The distance to the leader is 28. Two seconds. We're leading our teammate by forty-three point nine seconds. Okay. I genuinely cannot work out how to use the ERS. To stop cutting the corners, if you keep it up, the stewards will award you a penalty. Last few corners on debut, currently P7. And long may stuff like this continue. Cross the line. P7 on debut, that is not bad at all. Not bad at all. And Mercedes have off a great victory here today. What a start to the season this has been. A fascinating race here in Australia at. The top teams as ever continue to push the boundaries of the sport. It'll be interesting to see how the new Alfa Romeo driver Aidan Jackson settles in, especially after that early incident involving his teammate. Well, we've certainly seen rivalries born from less. Suffice to say, if you came into the 2020 season hoping for a bit of drama it looks like you won't be disappointed so after a magnificent race we can now see the drivers making their way to the podium once again it's the silver arrows who take top spot a well-earned victory for mercedes
So that's it. Australian Grand Prix. Done and dusted. Casper. Listen. I don't know what happened out there. It wasn't my fault. Well, whose fault was it then? Who was the idiot behind the wheel of your car? Hmm? You're pathetic. You won't even admit when you made a mistake. I'm... How did he ever sign you? Oh. Butler. Herman, uh, I didn't see you. What, like, how on the track today? You nearly took me out, mate. Look, I don't know what happened. You cut in, I swerved. Next thing I knew, Casper was out. Whoa, 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 whoa. Mate, I was nothing to do with it. Whatever that was, that was all on you. Don't be trying to pass the blame, because you haven't settled in yet. Fucking hell. Okay, just bear with us one sec. No problem. Taking out your own teammate isn't something I would make a habit of. Almost ready, Aiden. We're just checking audio levels. Uh, sure. Is no one going to talk about how we finished P7? Wondering what on earth Alpha Romeo was thinking. <laughs> <laughs> That's great. Thanks, David. Yeah. Great banter. It really is. Okay, Aiden. Let's talk about that incident with your teammate. Nice. I think that's a good place to call it for episode one. I'm very excited to find out what happens next though, and uh, I hope you are too. Thank you very much guys. See you in see you uh, fucking English. I'll see you in the next one, episode two, very, very shortly. Cheerio.